Hello everyone. Today we'll be taking up the first question in exercise 9.1 of chapter Some Applications of Trigonometry in Class 10th NCERT Book. So question 1 states that a circus artist is climbing a 20 meters long rope which is slightly stretched and tied from the top of a vertical pole to the ground. Find the height of the pole if the angle made by the rope with the ground is 30 degrees so what are we going to do is i'll consider ab to be the pole now let a point on the ground be c so bc here is the ground level and ab is the pole now the rope is stretched between two points so first point is the top of the pole which is a and the next point is the point on the ground which is c here so my rope is ac which is 20 meters long now they're also saying that the angle that this rope is making with the ground level or the angle at which this rope is inclined with the ground is equal to 30 degrees and i'm supposed to find the length of the pole that is ab now i know that in a right angle triangle the angle of this right angle triangle can be related to the sides of the right angle triangle and i'm doing that here this part i'm not explaining because this is something which already you must have done in chapter 8 so i will not be repeating that here assuming that you already know So P upon H or perpendicular upon hypotenuse is equal to sine 30 degrees I'll say cos 30 degrees will be equal to B upon H that is base upon hypotenuse here and tan 30 degrees can be written as P upon B Now I am only concerned with hypotenuse and perpendicular So I can write sin 30 degrees as equal to AB upon AC. So I've done that. Now I know sin 30 degrees value as 1 upon 2. So I can write 1 upon 2 is equal to AB upon 20 because AC is 20 given to us. Now next I simply cross multiply and I find that the value of AB is 10. So I know that the length of the pole is 10 meters. So I hope this question is clear to you. Thank you and all the very best.